Uh, Dave, there was, there was uh, surely some discussion. There was, there was lots of evaluation, but uh, from my standpoint, I absolutely believe that uh, isolating WVU out, you know, and, and then or and or isolating Marshall out, or then isolating out, you know, the University of Charleston or whatever it may be, I absolutely believe that that would have been the wrong thing to do. These people travel and move through our community in every way. They're part of our community. And, and, and so from the standpoint of our medical experts, we consulted and talked. We had multiple, multiple, multiple talks and everything about this issue and everything. We know the impact of, of, of WVU on Monongahela County. We got that. And from the standpoint, but we, have, we know that, that WVU is part of the county. I mean, and they, and as they move throughout the county with their students, with their staff, whatever it may be, they are part of the county and everything. And so therefore they have to be counted within the county. And so to, to isolate them out, I think really and truly just being a bad move. And, uh, and so, but our medical experts led me in just that. And, and I think Dr. Dr. Marsh would be best to answer that. Maybe we'll wait on him to come in tomorrow and he'll, he'll be able to answer that better than anybody. But, uh, but from my standpoint, the right move was to keep everybody together. And, uh, and I, I commend, you know, uh, President Gee in every way. Uh, you know, I love being with him every time I'm with him because he's, he's always stuck on on and he loves West Virginia and he loves our students and everything. And so he's trying to do all he can do too.